surrender. It's surrender. It can't be articulated so strongly. When I'm in surrender state, I say, Ave Maria, God help me, Mother of God. I decided to come uh, to this workshop with uh, com Tom Kraus because imme immediately uh, after I saw it in the list of, of projects offered by Enoa, then I saw, I, I, I thought to myself, I have to be there. This is uh, a great teacher with great uh, career, with a great experience on stage. I'm sure he has a lot to teach and he has a lot to say. And in fact, he has. Ah! Je m'en fous. La liberté en fait sur 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 la la, la bouche sur la gorge et le on travaille beaucoup comme ça c'est c'est assez ridicule en soi mais c'est très intéressant parce que là-dessus on arrive à trouver la liberté pour chanter nos airs. Everybody has their own habits and maybe little problems and so I need to adapt myself to them and I have to be like a mirror and then mirror back to them and then somehow find the, the, the solution, how to introduce more energy into the breath, how to help the throat and, and, and the entire vocal apparatus to totally relax and let itself be sung. And so it's different with every person and in every, every day is different. So one needs to be exceedingly attentive, totally open and very spontaneous. singer who says, I don't work anymore at all. I do nothing. I just, I am that I am. I relax, I surrender. Life breathes me. What I really try to find is freedom. And also when we study singing, we've been usually, usually conditioned into certain manipulations of the voice. And it's possible to be a very manipulative singer and to produce what would, could be called good results. You could be very skillful, but you always feel the, the coldness of, of, of the manipulation and the intellect in this. And I, personally, I don't care for that. And uh, so what I try to do, and what I think to a certain extent has already happened, that they let go of some of muscular manipulations and they learn to trust the natural intelligence of the body. Somebody compared our body to a huge jazz band who keep improvising. Now I've been an ardent student of singing my entire life, I think. And this is what I've come to, that it's the breath and it's the vowel. Ah, there is something wonderful about the vowel ah, when it is really, really pure. Ah. Maybe that's why the Muslims say, Allah. Allah. Because it's also the total, it's the total surrender. It's a pleasure to be in the same room working and um, sharing things with him. It's such a different way of looking to singing and so magical and so metaphysic. You just say, I'm here and I'm open. I'm open to go wherever I have to go and sing and sing for people. So I don't mind if it's now, tomorrow, 10 years time, I'm just learning. One very lovely aspect of teaching here is the variety of the music that the students bring me. Spanish pop songs from South America and Sarzuela, operetta, Italian, Monteverdi and, and, and Bach and, and French Baroque. And then we get to do uh, spiritual music and there's a vast riches. La façon dont, dont Tom Krause travaille est très intéressante parce que il parle énormément de, de spiritualité et de calme. Il n'est pas dans, dans le vouloir faire, mais le laisser faire. La, la respiration, l'air, le son, 
tout ça communique et, et, et donne un, un son. On ne recherche pas un son de chanteur, mais le son vrai. happy that Enoa is giving young people the opportunity to take part of these workshops. Then you can know other people uh, too, other singers. You can learn from each other. You can expand your, your network too, that's very important. And, uh, and yeah, also the opportunity to work with the, those gr great uh, persons like Tom. Yeah, that's really wonderful. Oh,